Do you want an easy appetizer or snack that you can whip up in less than five minutes? I've got just the recipe. I'm Christina from It Is A Keeper and I share tried and true recipes that anyone can make. I believe if you can read, you can cook. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm showing you how to make these easy salami roll-ups. Everybody loves them. They always get devoured when I make them. Now make sure you stay tuned to the end to learn my favorite ways to serve these and be sure to grab the full printable recipe in the video description below. So the first thing we're going to do for our salami roll-ups is make our filling. Now I like to use a small food processor for this task. It just makes it easier, but you don't need to. You could totally mix it up by hand. So to our food processor, I'm going to add a block of cream cheese. So I'm just breaking it up, get it all in there. And one more piece, stick it down in there, okay? And then we're going to flavor this up. So here I have some dried chives, some minced onion, garlic powder, and a little bit of ground black pepper. So everything goes in. Okay, get it all in there. Lid on and give her a whirl. Now you might have to open it up and smush it down, especially if you're using a small one. If you're using a bigger food processor, you might not need to do this, but I got the little guy out today. Seriously guys, I've had this since I got married. <laughs> it lasts forever. off the top. One more scrape down, I think we'll be good to go. It's looking pretty good in here. All right. I think we're done. Okay, so that was maybe what, like two minutes? <laughs> Not even. Okay, put this aside. So, super simple process. We're gonna take a piece of salami. We're gonna go in with our filling, put a nice layer in there. It's totally up to you how much or how little. And then we just roll it up. So you could do it in just plain rolls like this or you can make them fancier. I like to top it off with a toothpick and a green olive. And we'll just go in and keep doing the same thing. And voila, that's it. Just a couple of quick minutes and you've got these perfect little appetizers or snack. And see, it only took five minutes start to finish. It really doesn't get much easier. And like I said, these always get devoured. Now, before we dig in, let me tell you some of my favorite ways to serve these. Of course, they're a great addition to a charcuterie board or a lunch meat platter. And I found that friends who are trying to avoid carbs always go for these. Now, when my son was younger, I would make these and put them in his lunchbox with some crackers. And I like to make them for my late night snack attacks. You know, when the fridge starts calling your name late at night, these satisfy my cravings. So let's go in and give these a try. I can't wait. It's like the perfect snack. Now you can eat it, try eating it with the toothpick in. I'm gonna pull it out just so I don't poke myself in the eye. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. All I need is a Netflix binge-a-thon and a plate of these and I'd be a perfectly happy girl. These salami roll-ups are definitely a keeper. It's easy to see why they're always a hit. There are so many great appetizer recipes out there. 
I have an easy hack you can use to make fancy schmancy salami roses. Seriously, these look fancy, but are super easy to make. You don't wanna miss it, you can check it out here. I'll see you over there.